Hey, what's up, it's Chanel, and welcome to a little collection update. And uh, if you want, real quick, snag this download code to get the new Ritual Necromancy, Disinterred Horror. Press pause and snag that bad boy. The numbers are SWN75FXEK6. So go to http xvinylx.com slash download slash there's the code. Press pause if you can see it. If not, just write down what I just said. And today, speaking of the devil, oh yeah, Disinterred Horror LP on Dark Descent Records by Ritual Necromancy. Hailing from Oregon. I've had the cassette for a while, so if you want to watch my review, go check that out. First off, the gold looks amazing. As does the artwork on the actual LP. There's like this skeleton thing here, and then like a ritual on the B-side. It's fucking sick. And... Compared to the cassette, you get tons of just extra artwork and stuff, like, especially on the inside, like, alongside the lyrics and stuff. Just awesome, awesome stuff from Ritual Necromancy here. Fucking A. So glad this came in. Sounds great, like, seriously. Hails to Matt and Dark Descent, and... Ritual Necromancy for being one of the best bands in the death metal game right now. Fuck yeah. Grab that download code. This is going right back on the turntable after this video, and I forgot. My bad. We're going to be blasting Mutilation Rites, Chasm. The LP will be here Monday, I think, the USPS uh, thing said. So if you pre-ordered this... Finally, the LP is arriving, so get stoked. But I placed a gnarly order through Head Split Records, who happened to hook up a new newsletter. And right here, if you're into cassette tapes, or if you're new to cassette tapes, these four for 20 deals that Extreme, I mean, that Head Split do, are fucking great. Like, you'll see what I got, but I've yet to read through this yet, but there's like, uh, I, I love these newsletters. I have a bunch right next to me, but fuck yeah, head split records, and just wait till you see this order. But I'll start with, um, now I knew these are going to sell out immediately because they're extremely rotten production stuff that head split had, and you know. I didn't want to have to pay all the shipping and stuff. Like, I do have some stuff coming from Extremely Rotten as a gift. Hail's tie. But right here is Chaotin, where gods excarnate. I think that's how you say this. But this right here is Killtown Death Metal. If there's any way to fucking describe Killtown Death Metal, yeah, look no further than this demo right here. This is a goddamn monster. I've listened to this like six times already. Where gods excarnate demo number fucking one. It's hard to believe this is this band's first demo. It is so fucking good. And I know that Extremely Rotten still has copies because I know Head Split like sold out almost immediately, which is why I snagged it from them because it's something I wanted to get a physical copy of. Next up, before we jump into the head split pile, Mordium, Dinos Necromantis, hailing from Peru. 
seriously awesome awesome death metal this was like their comeback record from 2016 i think awesome awesome stuff and this is released on iron pegasus oh no it's licensed from iron pegasus but it is released through time worm records this right here is a goddamn monster seriously check out all of their material but I really really like their latest release a lot and yes I know it has the same artwork as Cyanide the Dying Truth but it's all gravy don't worry about it it's fucking good as shit that's all that really matters and it's a reissue I know that well it is a reissue but it came out originally in 2016 but just go back and check out some of their back catalog it's amazing but so is uh Dinos Necromantis Mordium from Peru and now these last four records cassettes are part of that awesome head split deal I was showing you here and what you get for 20 bucks are four absolute amazing demos and albums we'll start with Cyanide Hell's Rebirth. Fuck yes. So, so good. Death Metal Maniac, like one of my favorite Cyanide songs. On this awesome trans red tape as well. It's fucking absolutely devastatingly heavy. I mean, if you're a Cyanide fan, you know these three can do fucking pretty much no wrong. In my opinion, the American Bolt Thrower. But yeah, Hell's Rebirth is a great record. I fucking dig it, you know. Real heavy stuff. And yeah, Curse the Dead. Well, Curse of the Dead. And Trust No One, Death Metal Maniac, The Age of Hell's Rebirth, Fires That Consume, World Abyss, Powerhead, Sicken to Behold, and fucking Worm Feast. Amazing shit from Cyanide. And I think this came out in 2004. Awesome Chicago death metal. Cyanide, Hell's Rebirth. And now remember, you get all four of these tapes for 20 bucks. And I would jump on it before it sells out. Next up, we have Motor, an act of revenge. Cassette version through Head Split and Unspeakable Axe did the, um... CD version holy shit does this fucking kick ass as well and I love this clear fucking tape and whatnot just you know some real fucking sick stuff for some real future death metal from Chicago and yeah keep supporting underground filth head split records I love that fucking artwork too and uh, hit them up on uh, motoril.bandcamp.com or just go to the Unspeakable Axe website or just go to Head Split and pick this up before it's gone and you get five tracks of just pure fucking filthy death metal it's awesome awesome shit next up I'm absolutely in love with this band Repulsic Flower of Carnage. Now, I'm a real big Blood fan, and this band just reminds me of Blood so much, and in the best way possible. As you can see how many tracks are on here, it's just grinding, fucking, filthy death metal. It's so goddamn good. Definitely more grind-oriented, with gore so it's fucking gore soaked grinding death it's amazing and i'm pretty sure these guys are from chile i'm more yeah yeah santigo chile 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 <laughs> some real sickening uh promo photo i'm gonna have to censor it because there's boobies but yeah this duo is fucking absolutely repulsive Seriously amazing, amazing stuff. I fucking love it. 
I was listening to this before I, like, you know, pulled the trigger on the, uh, order and whatnot, and I was like, oh my god, this is fucking awesome. It was like that, um, Festering Wounds, uh, cassette that came with, um, one of the other 4 for 20 deals that Headsplit did a couple months back, and, yeah, this is one of the standouts that, you know, was one of those ones that I was kind of like, huh, I wonder what this is going to sound like, and it just fucking blew me away. Repulsive Flower of Carnage. Filthy, gore-soaked, grinding death. And lastly, I have no idea how to say this band's name, and I apologize, but, um, Auto... Autophagy? Auto... I, I'm sorry, but, uh, yeah. Demo 2018. Oh my fucking god, does this roll as well? Oh, I fucking love this demo so much. Like, I was blasting this a ton before, you know, pulling the trigger on that 4 for 20 deal. Autophagy? Oh, I guess that's how you say it. I have yet to hear anyone else say it, so don't kill me. But yeah, Autophagy, just fucking kill it here with this demo. And, you know, coming from a scene where everything's limited and fucking, you know, absolutely crazy right now when it comes to, like, just getting copies of shit. This was recorded by Charlie at Underworld Studios and sounds absolutely fucking ma amazing. And that's probably because Joel Grind mastered it as well. Just filthy fucking death metal. Like, that's kind of, you know... Right here is one of the main reasons I was very much interested in that 4 for 20 deal. Alongside Cyanide and whatnot and Molder. It was just that Repulsic was the only one that I hadn't heard yet. And it's one of my favorite tapes of the bunch. But this right here is fucking awesome. I'll put all the links below. Sorry I, you know, said this wrong. But Autophagy Demo 2018. Sick fucking shit. And yeah, Hale's fucking head split. Hale's Dark Descent Records. In case you didn't snag it earlier. Hopefully you could see that. This is for the new Ritual Necromancy. Disinterred Horror. And we've been blasting Mutilation Rights Chasm. And I apologize for my mispronunciation. Don't kill me, but have a good fucking weekend. Be safe and... Hells. <laughs>